So before we get into Reborn episode 19, I do want to give out a spoiler warning at the beginning of this video. Again, this is a spoiler warning. If you are not wanting to see any of the new stuff in Reborn episode 19, you should not continue watching. Yeah. Good morning and hope you all have been well. In today's video, we are going to be continuing on with our Pokemon Reborn Let's Play. And this is part 60 of the Let's Play, just to let you guys know. Uh, so yeah, so I guess with that, we shall get into the Elite Four. Uh, but before that, I thought I would show you guys the team and show you guys the items that I did get after Victory Road. I do want to say again, thank you to the one viewer for reminding me that once I finish Victory Road, I should go back to the Grand Hall, get some more money, and then buy a bunch of healing items. So yeah, I believe I personally have more than enough, but I guess we will see if I, I regret not getting any more. So yeah uh, so first of all we got 10 ethers now unfortunately i was right on the on the last episode sorry um that i guess you aren't really able to buy ethers i'm not really sure why even with like a bunch of department store stamps but it is what it is um i did get six pickup pokemon and unfortunately i guess i got really unlucky i kept getting a bunch of other items but ethers so that's why we have only 10 of them. I think 10 should be fine. If, again, I regret that, I guess I will regret that, but I guess 10 should be okay. Uh, but anyways, though, I uh, got 100 full heals. I believe I always had um, 99 hyper potions, and sorry for the voice crack there. Uh, 200 revival herbs instead of 150. Even at 150, I think I had more than plenty, but I decided to get 50 more just in case. I uh, got a few more max potions. And a few more full restores, so... Yeah. Again, if that is not enough, then this Elite Four is definitely going to be something else. But I believe that is more than plenty for the Elite Four, so... Yeah. Uh, but anyways, on to the team itself. So with all of the HM Pokemon, I decided to swap out their HMs for the Toxic TM. I might swap it to different TMs depending if I need to do that. But I feel like Toxic is probably going to be my best friend in the Elite Four. So yeah, again, I'm not really wanting to treat this like a no items run or anything like that. I will be using items if needed and I will probably Toxic stall here and there. So yeah. Again, if I think I can do a no items run, I will do a let's play in the future of Reborn no items, but for now, I'm not really sure if I will do that, and I don't really want to play this with that kind of mindset, you know, so yeah. Uh, but anyways though, same moveset besides uh, Toxic there, we have Charcoal on the Blaziken. Now, if I do need to swap out charcoal for, I guess, the fighting plate or something, I guess I can do that, but for now, I just put the charcoal on it. Uh, next up is uh, Sonar, the Noivern, same, mo same moveset, sorry, as always, and he has the Sky Plate. Next up is uh, Musharna, same moveset, and we added the Mind Plate. Next up is Bamboo. I believe he had Rock Climb, so I decided to swap out Rock Climb for Toxic. And this is our main Mega Evolution on the team. Next up is Flygon with the Hardstone. I tried finding my Earth Plate. I thought I had a few, but I guess I can't really find them. But um, um, I decided to put the Hardstone. And if I need to, I guess I can put on the Draco Plate, but I think Hardstone is fine for now. And last but not least is uh, Kling Klang with the Iron Plate, and I believe he had Rock Smash before, and I swapped that out for Toxic, so yeah. Now I also want to say this as well, I know some people may be wondering or thinking, 
why not go for a few better Pokemon? Like, why not get some pseudo legends and stuff like that? And the main reason for that is because this is my reborn OG team. I want to beat the Elite Four with the OGs, you know? That's just kind of my mindset. If there is absolutely no way I can get through this without my OG team, then sure, I'll swap out a few stuff. But with all of the healing items and stuff like that, I just don't think I can lose with this team. With, again, healing items right behind me, so... Uh, yeah. If I did, like, no items, I am, like, 90% sure this would not work. I couldn't even tell you what would work for a no items run for the Elite Four. I don't know. I just have to see everybody's team, but even with seeing everybody's team, I don't see it being easy at all um trying to do that and maybe i'm wrong i don't know but we'll see what happens in the future uh but anyways though i guess we'll get into this then oh that's cool so i guess that's like it's um like a badge thing to make sure you have the right badge for this so what is this um julia uh florina uh, Shelly. I believe Kane, if I'm not... No, not Kane. Corey, sorry. Mix the two up. Wait, no? I thought Kane was the... I thought he was the third one. Or, I, I keep saying Kane. Am I being dumb? Let me redo this. Julia, Florina, Shelly, Corey. Aya, that's who I'm forgetting. So we have Aya here, uh, Sira here, Noel here, uh, Radimus. Um, Luna, uh, Samson, Charlotte, Tara, question mark? I'm pretty sure this is Tara. This is CL. Um, Adrian, uh, Titania, and Maria, and then, uh, Hardy. And then Safra. Had a few hiccups at the beginning, but I got the majority of them. So let's go in here then. For a moment. I guess there's no going back now. Oh, it's Heather. Now, I also gotta remember... I do remember Heather being the, um... An Elite Four member... Uh, there was Heather, Laura, L. I believe was a member. I don't know what's going on with Bennett. He might be the fourth one. Um, I would say the fourth one is either Bennett, a character we don't know, or probably Anna. Because there is something interesting about Anna, so... I don't think she's some weak trainer by any means, but I don't know. Um, I would say either Bennett, Anna, or just somebody we don't know. I'm also kind of hoping, it's kind of a random thought, but it would be kind of cool if, um, uh, what was his name? Not Shade, um... Oh, that old man said a story. The challenger that went through the league. I thought it started with the letter S. I don't remember his name. Some of you might be know might know who I'm talking about. Oh, what was his name? It was like the legend of something. Or maybe I'm going crazy. I don't think I am. 
But anyways, if you get who I'm talking about, it would be cool if he may have been one of the um, Elite Four, but I guess we'll see what happens. Uh, but anyways, before I ramble on anymore. Hey, I was wondering when you were going to show up already. Jeez, you have any idea how long I've been waiting up here? I'll give you a hint, it's almost forever. Anna said I had to be here for something soon, but then it still took so long. Anyway, uh... Oof, uh, sorry for the pause there. Uh, to tell you the truth, there's something I've been wanting to say to you. I know I've been, well, kind of a brat, but even despite that, you were there to help me out in Amtreen. And even though I didn't really understand what was going on at the time, you were there at the doctor's place too. You and Shelly have always done your best for me, and even though I never deserved it, I'm not really used to people being nice to me. I mean, you saw what my dad was like, and I ended up finding an old journal of his. I guess I guess in his own weird way, I read that wrong. I guess in his own weird roundabout way, he was just trying to look out for me. It's a lot to take in, but I think I understand, even if I don't really know how to handle it. Um, God, I sound like Shelly right now. The point is, okay, thank you. For trying to help me even though I... Oh well, whatever. You don't care about all of that, right? None of that matters. You're here to fight. But if you underestimate me now, you'll be blown away. So let's not waste another minute. Salamence, it's takeoff time. For a moment. So who do you lead off with? Can we talk about the theme for a second? I actually kind of like this. This is really nice. I like this. That's right. I remember a viewer bringing it up too about the whole um, Elite Four theme. Ooh, I like this. This is really nice. Um, but before I get distracted by the music, uh, Crobat, um, Bamboo. If we get static, that'd be cool. No static. That's okay. Um. I could just do that and discharge, right? I don't see why not. Tailwind, okay. Actually, why can't I just heal here? Let me just see what he does. Frost poison, okay. Let me heal again. I'm just gonna have to discharge. Gyarados. Um, probably Musharna. Just go for Yawn. Oh, I'm about to get O-Code, aren't I? I have no clue if that mattered or not. And, yeah, um, maybe, but you probably have, well, would you have Earthquake? You do, okay. Let me get up my own Tailwind, actually. Um... Would I, uh, would I outspeed after... Yeah, I have to tell him. That did nothing. Um... Gonna have to start healing now. Yeah, if I... Yeah, if I knew about the Z-Crystal, I probably would have done something different, but... That's okay. What's good to know though is sonar outspeeds. I need to get a flinch here. 
Oh, never mind. I did not think that would have taken it out. I'm gonna run with it. Um, let me heal up Kitty here. No way I'd take one. Yeah, I didn't think so. Uh, going to you. I don't know if I can take a hit, but I'll see. I am totally fine with that. I'll use this opportunity to uh, reheal the team then. I'm surprised we took a hit. But again, just run with it. Uh, going to you. I'm gonna go for Yawn. I should take one. Yeah, I do. Okay. Let's do that. I could shift gear. Okay. Um. How much does this do? Close, but not enough. I'll go into you. Actually, I don't think I outspeed. Let me play it safe and heal up Sonar. Why Sludge Wave? Question mark. Um, no Ice Beam? Question mark. Oh, you already know what this means. Yeah, we are taking advantage of this. If it gets a crit, that's gonna really suck a lot. But no, I, I like this. I will take advantage. I'm surprised though, like why not Ice Beam? Like what is his moveset then? Like Sludge Wave, Rock Slide, Earth Power... What's the final move though? I don't know. I, I, I don't know. If it's a credit, it's gonna really suck for me. But I think we're good now. Okay, cool. And I'm surprised it didn't get a toxic at all. Archeops, stay in. Rock Slide should take it out. Yeah, I mean, we're plus six. I don't see why we don't outspeed our Oko anyways. Okay, you're out. Oh, Gengar, okay. I have sky high power, I won't back down. Well, this one wasn't too bad. I know I probably could have played a little better. I know that Gyarados threw me off um, for a moment with the, um, uh, the Z crystal, but... Now, you, if you can... If I probably knew that, I probably would have maybe made a little bit of a different play. But still, as long as you get Flygon with Naito King and just kind of heal stall Dragon Dance, not that bad. Not that bad at all. No, no, no. Well, I guess this kind of thing is expected from you. Anyway, don't think you've won yet. I'm just first in line, and you'll have to take us all down. Oh, also, I guess, you might need this soon. So you can borrow it, okay? But that means I want it back. You better not lose it, or I'll actually beat you up. Got it? Good. Oh, so I guess we... I wonder what that's for then. I mean, I guess we'll take it. Real quick before I do this though. Um, 
I don't want to use max potions. Let's just use up our hyper potions for this. And then I'll use my cotton candy here. I don't want to use like the max potions for like healing in between the battles, you know. Alright, sorry for the pause there. I kind of died for a second and had to get some water. Um, but anyways though, um, everybody's all healed up, save here, so I guess we'll go into the second part. Now, I don't know how many of these I will do this episode, I don't think I'll do all four in one episode, probably like, um, maybe like two, like do that, or do that battle from before and then this one. And then we could probably end it off and then do the other two. And then get into the whole, I guess, champion battle and all. And then just see how everything plays out from then on. That's what I'm thinking. But let's see what this is. Okay, so it's Laura. Welcome along to my garden. I believe this encounter has been a long time coming. I've heard much about your exploits, however you say that. And I understand that you were a driving force behind waking me up when I was under hypno spell. For this and everything else that you've done for my sisters, you have my eternal gratitude. However, I'm afraid there is one complication as you may be aware. Oh? Well, Madelon. This was the compromise we reached. I really hope it's not 6v12. That's kind of like my, thirst, my first uh, thoughts. Second thoughts, I kind of like this. It's, it, it's actually like really cool because like it really does seem like um, Bennett is like redeeming himself from like his past, um, I guess like ways on how he went about stuff. So it's actually kind of cool that he seems like a lot more like mature. I, I like this Bennett a whole lot more, you know, so yeah. Uh, but still, hopefully it's not 6v12, but this is Reborn. It really would not surprise me if they did something like that. Uh, but anyways, I think you know by now that Reborn's Elite Four are dual type anyway. After discussing the issue with the folks down at the Grand Hawk, they determined there was no harm in splitting those two types between two people. As long as we stick to the 6 Pokemon limit. Okay, so it is still 6v6, okay. I guess that's a really good thing for me. Um, it's effectively a typical match. I am aware that Bennett has a somewhat colored history, but I ask that you treat us as one and the same. I do not believe that one's condition in the past should determine their treatment in the present. I would agree with that, uh, for the most part. I would not be so well off if that were the case either. And damage done to any flower is erased which... It doesn't say which. Um, is a race each spring with a new one when a new one blooms sorry adaption however you say that to the circumstances is a necessary trait for any organism and nature possesses beauty exactly because it's either changing those who do not change inevitably fall behind in the world i have no intention of falling behind and i hope along that you do not either Laura and I will endeavor as partners to adapt to each other's battling style. Show us, Alon, how you've adapted to your conditions. Okay, Whimsicott, Galvantula. Um... What, I guess... Blaze kick and kind of want a tailwind. So that's out. Oh, I'm a million percent getting rid of the Venus Horde. That has got to go. I'm gonna heal up Sanders and just place kick it. That has got to go. Okay. 
same thing. I, I want that thing gone. And keep Sanders at full. So I'm out. Um, full Corona, okay. Um, probably you then. Hmm. Let's go after Whimsicott and Rock Slide. Of course I miss. That mattered a lot. Um, we might still be okay though, maybe. Uh, what's next? Leave Vanny, okay. So what's up with this garden thing though? I see that it's grown quite a bit in the background. Let me uh, revive uh, Sonar probably. That was a crit, okay. So we'll get rid of that. Sonar. I will heal probably you and probably go for Tailwind. I think that's safe. And then I should outspeed, right? I would think so. And I'll revive um, the Flygon. Oh, I don't outspeed, okay. Still at speed. Okay. But I think we're okay. Everything is blossoming quite nicely for you, isn't it? I hope you cherish this moment. Oh, that's literally it. Oh. Let me toxic then if it's gonna keep healing like that. And then blaze kick, um Yeah, I'm fine. I'll just air slash here. Um I will I don't know, bamboo. Just Dragon Pulse and I, I don't know, Air Slash. I could probably Super Fang too, but I don't think it really matters. Yeah, it doesn't really matter. We're fine. And I think that's it. Yeah, we did it. Okay. Yeah, this one honestly really wasn't that bad. I mean, again, yes, I'm using healing items, but like... No, this one really was not bad at all. I would say, um... I would say Heather was definitely slightly more scary than this. I'm impressive. I'll make note to study this later. Alon, do you know what a polis is? I'm just gonna say yes even though I don't. Um, impressive. Then you may already understand. I'm just gonna look that up actually. A polis, I believe is what he said. An ancient Greek something that I'm not even going to try pronouncing. Uh, discharge, lit, absolution. Is there another definition? Um, apolysis, or apolysis, sorry, however you say that. 
is the separation of the cuticle from the epidermis in the in arthropods and related groups uh, since the cuticle however you say that of these animals is also the skeletal support of the body and is in elastic it is shed during growth and a new covering of large dimensions is formed Oh, okay. I'm gonna pretend I understand that. Uh, then you may already understand how well you're growing. Butterflies and buttercups are not so terribly different. Everyone must find beauty in their own struggle to grow. I hope you do not miss the beauty in yours. One more thing before you go along. I owe you this. It should not have left your care in the first place. And mine as well. One half of the pair will hardly do well. It is better in your hands for the purpose it was meant than in mine as a simple memento. No more time to waste though. Your path is forward still. Big bro moment. Oh, what's this? Well, before I go any further, um, I would say this is probably a good spot to end the video then. And then next episode, we will battle the other two um, Elite Four members. And then I guess next episode will probably be the uh, champion. So, yeah. Uh, but anyways, though, thank you guys so much for watching. Definitely do appreciate it. And I will see you guys in the next episode. Good morning.